Present for the signing alongside the Secretary for Finance, Samuel Penius, was the Secretary for the Department of Transport, Matthew Wawoni, who elaborated on the significance of the occasion. This particular vessel from the Bogen, as I said earlier, uh, took a while, but we finally had it uh, delivered now in terms of the signing of the contract. This vessel is a purpose-built vessel, brand new. It will be built, by, uh, um, yeah, built in China by Nantong Shipyard. Twelve months is the uh, delivery period. The construction will start as soon as we make the down payment for the, uh, for the mobilization. Expressing that this comes as the maritime component under the Connect PNG program, Secretary Wawoni gave a highlight of the vessel North Bougainville anticipates. The North Bougainville one is a 42 meter, 200 ton vessel carrying capacity with 180 passengers. It's meant to serve the, uh, the most outer islands of uh, Bougainville, who are currently now facing uh, acute service of appropriate transportation, and also uh, part of Bougainville. Expressing gratitude for the gesture of boosting the work along this regard was the CEO for the North Bougainville District Development Authority, Felix Bryan. A SIP, Lomipel Bougainville, especially the outer atolls of Bougainville and Big Plasanto. For many years we have, we have had casualties, uh, planned your lives loose, planned your tongue loose, uh, schools are not able to receive fed, uh, supplies. Mr. Bryan further noted a challenge for the authority, giving assurance, however, of the resolution reached towards this. The challenge for us, the Lord Bougainville, is the management. Plan the time, we will buy more liquid ship, and the time will be rust because we have a management issue. But I can assure the department, Secretary of the Department of uh, Transport, um, Chairman of the NPC, that uh, we have a plan to make sure that there is a company which will put in place to, to ensure that this ship is self-sustainable. Also present for the signing was the CEO for the contractor, JJ Shipping, who expressed that the company looks forward to serving PNG in this arrangement.